Hey, I'm here with my good mate Richie. Yeah. We are here in Vanuatu and uh, we're just about to board the plane to Tana Island. A very remote uh, island and uh, yeah. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> yeah. Let's see how it goes. It's, it's raining a bit today but um, yeah. This is the airport. Uh, pretty rough. Um, but it's pretty cool here. We're about to board the plane here and there's no security whatsoever to go on the plane. I just walk with my water that I got from the outside and uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, they didn't check any bags, nothing. All right, so we are in the pickup here on our way to our uh, homestay. Yeah. We're gonna do it as locals we can here. You know, we're gonna do homestays. We're gonna hang around with the locals. Uh, we want them um, to show us how they cook their food, how they eat. Just the way they live. How they live and uh, also how they go fishing. We're gonna try to see if we can go with some fishermen and um, yeah. Just try some local stuff. Try some local stuff. So yeah, this is step number one. Ride, <laughs> ride like a local. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> this is the roads here, here in Tana. That's the big active volcano. We're gonna hike tonight. So we're up on the volcano here now, just waiting for a tour guide to uh, decide if we can hike up the last bit to the crater or not. Hopefully we will get there. Can't see much but it's still pretty impressive. The noise is pretty impressive though. Yeah. Nice! Look at this. I think they need a couple of days, but yeah. A few days. Nice. We're gonna check out our accommodation, which is a tree house. <laughs> <laughs> Let's okay. check it out. Let's go. And you can see here the ground and the soil is all from the volcano. It's all black. Let's see. No, you don't want to be too drunk here. Second room. Thank you. Okay. Here we have two beds. <laughs> Very simple. That's the view. In, in our, our local made, mm -hmm. in our culture, this we call, uh, we call, we call it Jesus. <laughs> Jesus? Yes. Okay. Because, uh, do, do you make drinks with this? No, no, I mean, No drink? Because J-E-S-U-S. Jesus. Jesus. Jesus flower. Jesus flower. Huh? Oh! some other ceremony I think there's a cover ceremony we're just walking through the jungle to get there um, yeah this place is super cool it's, it feels so untouched there's uh, no motorbikes no horses or no hardly any cars either everyone is just walking around dirt roads and um, yeah they live in simple villages in the tribes so it's pretty cool let's see what happens here now 
But now we drink kava. I like that even now. Yeah, when they said that, I was thinking, you know, when he said, do you prefer to pay for the machine? <laughs> <laughs> we do it free, we just chew on it and then spit out and then mix it with water and then we are going to drink it. I think sometimes, you know, you, you, you've got to close your eyes, you know. Yeah, you're just going to have to, uh, like, accept their culture, obviously, and um, the way of doing things. Uh, yeah, it's literally one guy sitting there, chewing all the roots and uh, spitting out, out on a leaf, leaf and then the, uh, mix it with water, and then we drink it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they said you can either go here, where it's free in this hut, and um, here it's only men that are allowed to be. Uh, or they have a kava bar which women also are allowed but then you pay a little bit for it and um, also they have a machine instead of a guy just chewing the roots down so it's, it's quite a lot of work actually yeah it's quite a Maybe lot of chewing even already high <laughs> yeah probably it's like some big roots yeah yeah they're probably two three guys that just sit there and chewing chewing out <laughs> And it comes out like a big paste. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, he's chewing it quite a lot as well. Like it's not only two, three bites. It's um, yeah. chewing it like a cow. Yeah, yeah, but it's very interesting to see. Yeah, yeah, and uh, more interesting to see how we feel after a few kavas. And this is what you drink from from the half of a coconut. <laughs> That was a lot, huh? Yeah. That was a lot that they were drinking. Oh my god, yeah. How, how is this gonna go? Same <laughs> boy. in the village. It was super good, magical. Uh, yeah, it was uh, super interesting to see the way they live and dance. Yeah. What about you? Yeah, so cool. They are so uh, good at dancing and everything. And uh, it was very cool that we could speak to them for a while now. And uh, I asked them um, how they are breathing. Um, and they said they only breathe with, only with their nose. So. That was pretty interesting and uh, I noticed that they all have very beautiful smile, perfect teeth, even very white teeth as well. And uh, I guess that's from all the roots and all the organic food and vegetables and stuff they eat here. No other tourists or anything, it's just very remote. I had to walk here for 45 minutes through the bush to get here. And um, yeah, it's cool, we can hear the Volcano erupt every now and then. Sounds like uh, the thunder is going, but it's the volcano. Everything is uh, on this island is kind of like based around the volcano. Yeah, like yeah. All the songs that they are singing, 
it's a, uh, like yeah it's about the volcano and 